I genuinely couldn't believe when I heard Jack Edwards say this. So for those who don't know, Jack is the sometimes heavily maligned commentator for Nessun, which is the home channel for the Boston Bruins. Double digits from a front row fan. <laughs> Read the scoreboard, buddy! He's one of the biggest homers of the TV commentators and certainly the most famous ones. I don't like him. I've been clear about that in the past. A lot of people do. He had, I'll just call it an interesting quote about Patty Maroon. So Maroon had just played a shift where he won like four or five individual puck battles against the Bruins. And Edwards followed up by basically calling him fat. Listed it, 238 pounds. <laughs> That was day one of training camp. I, I got a feeling he's had a few more pieces between then and now. <laughs> Chris, <laughs> inadvertent fasting for Pat Maroon is like four hours without a meal. Now, I had to somewhat limit how much I included in this because of copyright reasons, but essentially he makes a comment about his weight. He says he's eating pizza all the time and that inadvertent fasting for him is when he doesn't eat for four hours. However, and I have to include this because some of the clips I've seen floating around didn't. He did also say if he's won this many Stanley Cups, hey, what can you say? And he's a role player that's been valued by every teammate he's ever had. Now, am I offended by this? Absolutely not, but it is a bit weird. Making a fat joke about Pat Maroon is nothing new. It's just the way he sort of lazily went on about it for a while. It's just weird. Like this is a dude in his mid to late 60s talking about a professional athlete who just had a great shift. And I don't know. Jack's always been bad in my opinion. Again, I understand why some people like him, but this year he's just been different. Even earlier in the game, it's like the way he calls it. It's gotten even more, I don't even know the right word, like floaty, I guess. Did not cross the goal line. Here's a referee about to humiliate himself between the boards and in front of 19,092 people. Anyway, Pat Maroon responded by tweeting today in support of those struggling with mental health, bullying, and body image. I'm making a $2,000 donation in name of Real Jack Edwards to Tampa Bay Thrives, and I encourage Tampa Bay Lightning and NHL fans to join me. The Hurricanes, who love jumping in on things like this on Twitter, say, We stand with Pat Maroon in supporting those who struggle with mental health, bullying, and body image. We encourage Kane fans to donate $19 out of spite for Jack Edwards. The 19 has to do with a weird rant. Edwards went on about Dougie Hamilton wearing 19. That number was retired for the whale. They became Carolina, of course, and Dougie wore 19 when he played for the Hurricanes. Again, is what Jack Edwards said that bad? No, and I don't see anyone trying to have him fired or even have to apologize or anything like that. It's just kind of a shitty bit of commentating when he probably should have just been talking about the game. Just my thoughts, though. Let me know yours down below.